Merry Christmas in July! Hi guys, this is Crafty Cat. Welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new. We are here with a brand new unbagging video from a new company. You guys, it's not cancels. So, let's take a look and see what we got. So there should be some Christmas in July items in here. And we'll be looking at them one at a time. But I'm just going to open the bag. And it looks like we have some that are in baggies. Or bubble wrap envelopes. And some that are not. So let me just sneak a peek off camera. I don't even know who these are from. So... I can't see anything in here telling me who I ordered from, you guys. It just says made in China. I know it's not fan cells. I did. I know I did do one order from um, Your Best Deals, but this is not that. So hang on a second while I look. It might be from One Day Savings. Yes, it is. This is from One Day Savings, you guys. So there are two diamond paintings in here that I ordered that are for Christmas. All right. So this one, I found the item number, so I know this is one of the Christmas ones that I ordered for Christmas in July. Okay, guys, so I've positioned the camera. Hopefully, I won't be hitting it. And we're opening this brand new diamond painting. So this is from One Day Savings. I've never ordered from One Day Savings before. But I ordered for Christmas in July. Here we go. So first of all, I'm going to pull out the insides like I always do. Oh, oh I'm so excited. They're pre-bagged. Pre-bagged. And they seem to have numbers on the bag, but they're not labeled for what this is. Um, so I'm going to have to write something on there before I do any other unboxings. And... We've got the regular toolkit with the green boat, pink pen, red wax. And I have completely gotten annoyed with the red wax while I was working on my last diamond painting. So now I've gone back to trying to use the glue dots. And then they kept falling out. So, you guys, what do you use? Let me know. And this is a thin canvas, which is good because I find the thin, like the thinner, lighter canvases, sometimes they, um, they're easier to unroll and it seems like it's been folded instead of rolled and that's another thing that seems to work better so off camera I'm just going to roll it backward and let's take a look what did we get ah <laughs> look how cute he is it's a Christmas mouse or rat I guess I just think he's adorable look how cute he is so anyway you guys this is number a1705 from one day savings it's only 30 by 30 it has 19 colors and hang on a second i've got to put my glasses back on i think i need my focals so the 19 colors we have all alphabet letters but not in alphabetical order and we also have the dmc code over here and the gel fill looks good. I've got the overhead light on, so I apologize. Um, let me pull this back. See if you can get a better look. Okay, my camera is focusing a little bit better. So now in the camera, the ends look really blurry. The camera doesn't want to focus on the white letters. But without the camera, they look fine. Very good stick, you guys. Very good stick. And look how cute this is. So I'm just going to put this here on my light pad for a minute, and I'm going to have to grab my little kit. Hang on a second. So I keep a lot of stuff in this. I don't know what it is. I call it a giant pencil case. It's like really big, but it's just like a pencil case. So normally when I'm working, I have an actual pencil case. With the drill, with my uh, my blue little thing that I like to use, my boat, and my extra boat just for this, the wax and my pens that I'm using. 
and I've got my labels in case I need them. And we do have my bigger labels. So let's label this so I don't forget what it is. Usually they come labeled. So I'm surprised that this doesn't have any kind of label on it. But this is, I'm just going to call it Christmas Mouse. And that way I can leave this little guy out to flatten him. And not worry that I won't be able to find the drills. So that is good. And I think I'll just leave this stuff out for now. But how cute is he? He is absolutely adorable. I really like him a lot. What do you guys think? Isn't he sweet? I love animals, you guys. I love mice. Now, I used to be a teacher. And um, I ended up with all of the animals one summer. My first year teaching... The principal said, can you take care of all the classroom animals? And I had no idea she meant all the classroom animals for the whole school. So that year, and I have asthma and allergies, so I'm allergic to animals that aren't poodles. But that year, I had rats, turtles, fish, birds, okay? Um, lizards. You, like, if there would have been a spider, I would have refused. But I took everything else. The thing is, I already had my own animals. So I already had my own birds and dogs. Um, oh, a rabbit. Yeah, so my house was like a walk-in petting zoo for a while. And then the teacher who had the two rats wouldn't take the rats back, so I ended up with the rats. So I was not a rat fan until then, but they're just like little mini dogs, you guys. They are just like mini dogs with weird tails. They come like a dog when you call them. They want affection like a dog. They will actually play fetch. Um, they're really cool animals. So anyway... In honor of my principal who forced these animals on me, I had the two rats. I named them Nancy and Fran after my principal and vice principal. I renamed them. I don't even remember what their original names were. But anyway, that reminded me of that story. <laughs> but look how cute. My rats were tan with white with white marks on them. All right, guys, I'm going to leave this here. I hope you liked it. Um, If you want to do Christmas in July with me, it's not my idea. It is Diamond Grandma who had this wonderful idea to do Christmas in July. Lynn Parrish, I think is her last name. I'm not sure. I know Lynn for sure. Um, so go check out her channel if you haven't already. She's awesome. So I've got my little colorful... You guys can't see it because it's so bright in here. With this changes color. My aunt got me this for my birthday. And I thought, you know what? I've got the little Christmas lights out, but this is Christmas in July. So it's a summer Christmas, so we've got our bright multicolored pineapple. So I'll be pulling this out when we do Christmas in July stuff. So July will not be just Christmas in July, I don't think, unless I get enough stuff to do. Um, there, there's probably going to be more unboxing and baggings that aren't Christmas related, just because I, I can't do like a whole month's worth of unboxing and bagging. But probably all of my completions this month will be Christmas in July. So, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Let me know if you're joining us in Christmas in July. That'd be awesome. And um, leave your comments. Subscribe if you haven't already. Hit that notification bell. But most importantly of all, you guys, take care. Stay safe. Happy diamond painting. And ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas in July. Bye, guys.